Hey, how's it going, everyone? Mike Keeper here. Today, I'm going to unbox my new Redshift kitchen sink handlebars. Um, I don't particularly like the uh, handlebars that have come stock on my Kona Sutra. I was actually thinking about selling my Kona Sutra. So I'm hoping that these bars are uh, going to make me uh, have a comfortable ride. So let's, uh, let's get these open here. Take a look. Ooh, exciting. So first off, what's this? Oh, that's right. I bought the little uh, inserts that go under the uh, under the bar tape, which is also right here. Some really long bar tape. So these here, let's let's open these up, and I'll show you what these are. This is this is going to uh, really help, you know. And I probably could have just bought these for the for the bar. So oh, there's. Some bar tape. <laughs> it's see those? So those go under the bar or under the tape on the bar. And tape. Let's take a look at these bars. Oh, they're really light. Oh, those are sweet! Oh man, these are sweet! Oh, they're so light! Oh my god, they're so light! Oh my god, those are flipping awesome! Oh, that is... Look how... Look how low that drop is! Look how low... Wow! I am, uh, I am happy with the way these look. Um, yeah, so these, let's get this right off here. Excuse me, I don't know what I'm doing, obviously. These go on this side, this side. There. There we go. Those go on there like that, see? Look at that there. That's awesome. Oh, these are freaking badass. Look at those. Yes. Very happy. Let's go uh, install these on the Sutra and see how they look. Sweet. See, yeah, uh, they're a little bit wider, but not by much because I didn't want to go too wide. I have to get all new cables. Um, oh, that looks sick. These are going to look sick. Just remove that. I want to take a good look on how this is wrapped starting from this end because I've never done this before. So I hope you're not watching this as a how-to video because I don't know how to and I guess I could watch a YouTube video on how to and I probably probably will. But I didn't say this is a retaping my bars video. This is a handlebar install. I might bring this to the Comox Bike Company and have them install the tape. Save myself the headache. Oh, there's... Okay. Aha. There we go. Okay, so let me see. Sweet. So 
it over. Over. Let's see. Okay, brake cables. They're taped down too. Okay, so what I'm going to do real quick is see what this is like to tape bars. You know, when I tape, when I do tape them, it's not like I need a super pro. I should be able to do this. I should be able to retape my own bars. Oop. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't look as awesome as the other side, but it wasn't really giving my absolute best effort either. Okay, so it's over the bar. And I said that already. <clears throat> but it could be different because the bar tape I have has writing on it that I don't want to cover up. Let's see. Okay, so let's get here. Okay, so this came over this way and then came over this way and around and then up and around so when we go off it's coming up this way so let me see. The problem is gonna come when I put the inserts in. We'll see. <clears throat> One side undone. So this one's going this way around, right? Left side is wrapping. Her. So the side's wrapping. 
the other way. Oh, I'm sure I'm glad I'm filming this. save the wrapping of these handlebars for tomorrow. Oh, are you supposed to slide them down? Is that how you do it? No. Oh, it is, eh? Well, I'll be damned. I'll be damned, son. Okay, well, fuck. That means I gotta unwrap all these then. Okay, not the end of the world. So, wrapping this side, this direction. All right. All right. Okay. You guys getting excited? Yeah, these bars are pretty light too. Now, let me clean these. Let me clean these off. Now, you don't want to thread these in all the way. You just want to get them lightly in there. And of course, if you're feeling any resistance, stop. Do not cross thread.
And then let's look in here. They got nice markings for me to be able to tell that I'm right in the center. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, those look so sick. They've even got a rise. See, that's what that's what I that's what I really wanted was that rise right there. Those look great. I'm really hoping these change my feelings about drop bar handlebars because up until now, I'm not really sold on them. These, these look like a game changer. Okay, so with these markings here, see I've got this lined up with the big dot there. So we gotta do that with the other side. So I hit my knees on the bars. Well, that's disappointing. That's really disappointing. All right, so I've been spending some time adjusting the angle of the bars here. And I think I have found a spot where, you know, unless I'm turning really super sharp, um, I don't hit my knees um, anymore. So that's, that's kind of, that makes me happy.